What up, people? Base Logic. One of my favorite things is watching people get exactly what they ask for. When people are given wisdom, given advice, when they go against it, and they get exactly what they ask for, there's nothing better than that. Nothing better than just sitting back and watching idiots get exactly the shit that they ask for. That's one of the good things that happened from this last election. Even though Trump lost, we get to sit back and watch the fucking shit show. So in this video right here, we're going to see some people that are outraged at the fucking laws that I'm pretty sure some of them help enact. Check out this video. We'll talk about it. We, we spa. So you don't. So it's OK. I just want to be clear with you. It's OK. It's OK for a man to go into the women's section, show his penis around the other women, young little girls under age, your spa, we spa, condone that. Is that what you're saying? Like I asked. It's so he, so he can stay there. Yes. He can stay there? Yes, ma'am. Yes, he can. What sexual orientation? I see a dick. It lets me know he's a man. He, he's a man. He is a man. He is not no female. Yeah. He is not a female. Yeah, that's what we've been saying. He is not a female. Hold on. He is not a female, sweetie. Okay. Girls down there, other women who are highly offended for what they just saw. And you did nothing. Absolutely nothing. In fact, you sided with him. So we spa is an agreement with men that just say they are a woman and they can go down there with their penis and get into the women's section. Is that what you're saying? Don't what, be a bigot. What, really? What law? What Let's law? Let's not be a bigot, lady. The law so you voted for, problem. The with their breasts. Yes, they can do that okay. too. Yes. Yeah, you shouldn't. Yeah, I wouldn't come back either. Yeah, get your money back. You got a man with his penis talking about he's a woman. He ain't no woman. Uh uh. This lady's yeah, trying to get locked the fuck back. up. This lady's trying There's to go to no jail. There's no such thing as transgender. He has a dick. <laughs> okay. He has a penis. He has penis is hanging out. Okay, no, cup. I'm not one. Actually, I'm a woman who knows how to stand you're, you're up and being speak a dick. up for Look my at the right. Cup. As a woman, I have a right to feel comfortable. Hey, I'm gonna have to have a talk with you, white boys. Man some of y'all raised this himself. little white boy. Okay. He's no, somebody's you go brother. Somewhere else. Okay, so that's what right. going on here. No, he's not a transgender. He has a penis, just like you do. Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? No. Yeah. Okay. It's not okay. It's not okay. Okay. That's traumatizing to see that. I'm a woman. I think this is a place right here. I'm told only for women. So how dare you sit up here and tell me I don't have a right as a woman? <laughs> you know, to the pen. You I'm telling you, he has a penis, <laughs> a full and testicle. Okay, and testes. And it, it's got balls too. You call, it's a man. You got one? You're a man. Okay. And if we went into the men's section with our anatomy, that would be okay with me. Well, it wouldn't probably, but you might not yeah, like that. women, so it might not. Okay, and we don't know. But it's for me and for a lot of other women, they do not, not feel okay. comfortable, and it's not okay. Okay? So, well, I, yeah, yeah, you're sorry. You should be, sweetie, and you're out of alignment, and this is not right. I can tell you that much. Out of alignment, nigga. All right? And I know you're out of work. Yeah, it must be hard. It must be hard not being a real man, huh? You little Try pussy. It. So, like I said, <laughs> uh, I want every woman to get all of their information on... Okay, well, I don't care what the security guard, he's just security. I don't care what the fuck, yeah. so what? Yeah, yeah you about to see a nigga okay, well, come no, out now. In there. Okay, well, security. No, 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 he doesn't want to Oh, okay. She about to show y'all what the fuck y'all want. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, we know that. Exactly. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Exactly. No, so. we knew that. Yeah, good shit. Let me, let me go full screen right quick. Hold on. Hold on. Now, that's the type of shit that I'm talking about. Oh, I guess it's not going to go full screen. Fuck it. But that's the type of shit I'm talking about. People voted for shit that they didn't even know they voted for. A lot of these people running around, fuck Trump, he's a racist, all of this old shit, voting blue, voting Biden. You weren't voting blue. You weren't voting Biden. You was voting for men to come into a fucking female spa with their cock and balls out. That's what you were voting for. Now you're outraged when the shit comes to you. It's fucking beautiful. I love sitting back watching this shit. You, you getting what you asked for. This is exactly what you asked for. 
You ask for men to be able to come around your daughters butt ass naked and say they're females. Now, now you get it. But another issue I have with that goddamn video, that white boy that came up. Hey, listen, if you watch my videos, you know I don't have a problem railing against black dudes when they out there fucking up, doing harm, doing just stupid nigga shit. I'm the first one to go at them. What's up with these white boys, man? I'm going to need the white boys in the white community or the white men in the white community to start checking these cucks. Who raised this little fucking pussy? He's got to be somebody's brother or cousin, nephew. What the fuck type shit are y'all raising in, in, in y'all communities where a female is expressing her problem with a cock being in a female locker room and some little pussy ass white boy come up defending him? What's going on? Is this what y'all teaching at home that is strength and solidarity? Hey, cut that shit the fuck out. Kudos to that woman for going off on those motherfucking people. Because, you know, everybody needs a wake-up call every now and then. But I hope she wasn't in New York. Because if she was, she's going to have some motherfucking charges coming. She's going to have some misgendering charges coming. Uh, Probably simple assault. All types of shit. She's going to fuck the jail. But at least she said what all of us rational motherfuckers want to say. You niggas out here with cocks ain't women. Cut this shit out. I'll catch y'all later. Peace.